Good morning children. Today I am going to teach standard 3 science chapter 2 parts of a plant. In this chapter you will learn about different parts of a plant and its functions. So children let's begin. Children see this picture carefully. What is it? It is a plant. Like humans and animals plants also have different parts. Each part of the plants has important functions and these parts work together to live and grow. So remember this children, these parts always work together to live and grow. Students, a plant's body is divided into two main parts and what are they? First is root and the second one is shoot. Now we'll discuss about each part in detail. Let's understand about root. What is root? It is the part of a plant that grows under the soil. Or we can say root is the underground part of a plant. It always grows downwards and spreads under the soil. Roots are of different shapes and size. And children, we cannot see root above the ground. It is always found under the ground. Children, now let's understand about the various functions of the roots. Roots perform various functions which help a plant to grow well. Okay, the first function is roots fix the plant to the soil. So, if roots will not be there, then what will happen? A plant would fall down. So, it's very important that a root plays a role in a plant's life. Okay. The second part is, second function is absorption. Roots absorb water and minerals from the soil. And then these are sent to other parts of the plant through the stem. So, uh, whatever water we used to put in the soil, all those things roots absorb, okay, and then it transport those water minerals through the stem, which is very important for the growth of the plant. As you can see some pictures here, these are some special roots which store food in them, like beetroot, radish, carrot, turnip, etc. These are special roots which can be eaten as both raw and in cooked form. Further, roots are divided into two parts that is tap root and fibrous root. Children, look at the picture carefully. What you can see? There is a main root and from that main root several thin side roots are grown out. Okay, can you see there is a main root and from that main root you can see several thin roots are coming out or grown out. This is what is a tap root. Most trees have tap roots and few examples are carrot, reddish, beetroot, turnip, hibiscus, etc. Tap roots grow deep into the soil. Now let us discuss about the second type of the root that is fibrous root. It has no main root and many tiny thin roots are grown out from the base of the stem. So you can also see here in the picture there is no main root and the thin uh, roots are coming out as in the bunch form it is coming out from the base of the stem. Some examples are rice, wheat, onion, grass etc. So these are called fibrous roots. Children I hope that you might have understood the topics nicely. Here are a few questions which you can answer easily. First question is, name the different parts of a plant. Second question, 
write two functions of roots. Third, how can you differentiate between a tap root and a fibrous root? And the last question is, give some examples of edible roots. Thank you children. Hope you all like this video. Soon we'll meet in our next part. Till then, stay safe, stay healthy and stay quarantined.